Hey guys, it's your boy Utoxicake back again with another Battlefield video and uh, so today we're talking a bit about my current opinion on Battlefield. Battlefield 1 was an amazing game. I know that right now. It, you already know that from my quote unquote review when I changed it to like my opinion on the review. And now uh, we got quote unquote leaks that the next Battlefield will be Bad Company 3. People are really excited for this, but I my first Battlefield ever was Battlefield 1, and then I played a bit of Battlefield 1942. So I'm really used to the historic accuracy, and it felt really authentic. And this leak about the next Battlefield game, which was beforehand called Battlefield 2018, uh, it's going to be set in the Cold War, and this was leaked by the same person who leaked Battlefield 1 ba uh, back in a while. So he does have some level of credibility. He also said that Back Company 3 is going to be set in the Cold War and is getting made by DICE LA. Keep that in mind, DICE LA. DICE has two studios in Sweden and LA. Now, this sounds great and all, but it's not my game, but you know, it's just my personal preference. And I'm in the massive minority about not liking the idea of Bad Company 3. But people are really, really concerned mainly because DICE has screwed up in the past quite a lot. And by in the past, I mean literally two months ago, they released Battlefront 2, which, let me say, had some problems. And if you're wondering what is that, go ahead and watch that You Toxic Cake Stars Battlefront 2 video. And now people are really scared that EA will implement more microtransactions into Battlefield Bad Company 3. But, you know, after the backlash, they they somewhat fixed it up. And so, it, it, there's a chance that it will be ruined. Anyways, getting back into Battlefield Bad Company 3. They say that, once again, it's going to be in the Cold War, but not historically accurate. They say it's going to be more like Battlefield 4, and it's going to be more close quarters. And there's going to be faster tempo and tighter gameplay rather than all-out warfare which is one of the reasons I'm really scared about it because I feel it's gonna it's gonna be like Call of Duty especially Call of Duty World War 2 because the Cold War and World War 2 you know they were kind of close together so it's gonna resemble it but not only that it's that Battlefield are making another historically accurate game yes you heard me right DICE Sweden for the win, they're coming in with a with another historically accurate game, and they're the guys who made Battlefield 1, and Battlefield 1 was really good, and it's gonna be, you guessed it, Battlefield World War 2. And if you say they copied COD World War 2, haha, <laughs> no they didn't. Not too much is known about Battlefield World War 2 yet, but it was leaked by the same person who leaked Battlefield 1, and now quote unquote leaked Battlefield Bad Company 3. The guy also says that Battlefield World War II will be visually stunning and that it's possible to have a new engine. Like I said, there will be cosmetic only transactions for both of the games. And apparently, apparently, a image of Battlefield World War II, the PPSH weapon, an image of it was leaked and I'm putting up a picture of it right now. I will leave a link to the article about Bad Company 3 in the description. Now keep in mind that everything everything about this is just purely speculation and DICE has actually never confirmed any of this and we can only half trust this guy on Reddit. So I'd like to know what you guys even think about this. Do you, do you trust him? Do you not trust him? Do you even care? And if I see a comment saying that COD World War 2 is better than any of the battlefields, I don't know what I'll do with you, so I'll kill you all. Anyways guys, that's enough of you toxic cake for one day, and I'll see you guys next time.